What's up, y'all, man? Y'all know what time it is, man. Today, we're going to be checking out Steve Earle, Copperhead Road. All right. Now, I'm not a lot to y'all, man. I had, to, I, I, I had to do it. I couldn't go in too blind. I looked up what Copperhead Road is, bro. <laughs> I was clueless, man. And apparently, it's a, it's, it's a road, a real road that exists. And uh, it's from it's from Mountain Mountain City in Tennessee. That's about all I know, bro. But uh, I have no idea who Steve Earl is. This will be my first time checking him out. Uh, I'm pretty clueless about everything else as far as this song goes. But I'm ready, man. I'm diving into this artist for the first time, digging into his catalog a little bit, and hopefully we're gonna dig into some more after. But before we get started, if y'all got other artists, other songs y'all would like to see me check out. Let me know down below in the comments. And if you do enjoy the video, please subscribe. Let's do it. shy from great wordplay i mean i absolutely love what he's doing with this man he started off by saying his name then he said same as my daddy and my granddaddy before so he let me know he's he's the third you know what i'm saying he's the third of the generation but the way he said it was already just absolutely unique you know what i'm saying it was really unique and i must say from a poetic standpoint I could tell he about to really do some stuff, man. Yeah, he could tell he's a great storyteller, and uh, I'm looking forward to it, man. I really, I really wanted to talk about that bagpipe. I think it was bagpipes. Um, I believe there, there it's, it's some, it's some kind of instrument that he did that was really, really adding to the feel of this song, man. Especially early in it, man, and I really, really enjoyed that. Then he brought in another string, a string instrument. It was a guitar. But it had a unique sound as well. So I'm hearing a lot of unique stuff from this guy so far. And I must say, I'm thoroughly, thoroughly enjoying it. Steve's work, man. Let's go. Everybody knew that he made moonshine. He made some moonshine. I'm a revenue man on a granddaddy bed. Head left a holler, left a thing head. For my time, but I've been told to never come back from Copperhead Road. Shots of candy share painting on the side. Just shot a coat of primer and looked inside. Well, him and my uncle tore that engine down. I still remember that rumbling sound. Yeah, come on, man. And the sheriff came around in the middle of the night Heard mama crying that something wouldn't right He's headed down to Knoxville with a weekly load You can smell a whiskey burning down Copperhead Road Oh, shit, hold on, bro Y'all don't not do that to me, man Oh, they can't do this, bro He, I think he might have passed away, bro Because he said, you know, you can smell the whiskey burning down the Copperhead Road, bro. He can't, you know, because he's saying the sheriff came and mama was crying. It was, that's messed up, bro. That's sad, man. But I, 
I must say, man, this guy is an absolutely ex exceptional storyteller. You know, from from talking about how his dad sold the whisk, I mean, the moonshine, and then digging into, you know, kind of how his dad drove. You know, he, he was selling the whiskey and he was driving in the Dodge. I mean, I just love his wordplay. I like it. And I, and I feel like he was kind of building the song up, not only with his voice, but with the use of the instruments in the song as well. And you could tell this song is building, man. And, I, and, I, and I'm really liking it, man. I, I'm thoroughly enjoying this. I don't know what kind of category I would say this is. Like, because it's got a country feel for sure. I mean, heavily. But uh, I mean, it, there's a lot more to it and a lot going on. So I don't really like to categorize music like that. But uh, I, I will say this is probably one of the most unique songs I've heard in, in quite a while, man. Seriously. <laughs> So creative, man. I, 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 I'm a, I cannot wait to dig into more of this, bro. Especially after, like, what is this? These, like, brown, brown. Like, I, I can't even. Hey. The trap of white trash first trap here in a way. I've done two tours of duty in Vietnam. I came home with a brand new plane. It seemed like he was kind of telling a story like that was, you know, probably not 100% true. It was probably like a little like, I don't know, like a myth. I don't know what to call it, bro. But I will say, man, I thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyed what he did with it. And uh, I, I couldn't name a single bad part of it, man. It was just, it was all around amazing. And uh, it was like th the use of the instruments made me feel like every single time he ended a sentence, bro, he came with an instrument that, that was like unique and it added like a little flair to the end of each line. And I loved it, man. I absolutely loved it, man. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please like the video and subscribe. As always, I love y'all. Peace out.